Hello dear students, I welcome to our YouTube channel Literature Insights, an easy platform to learn English language and literature in English. If you have not subscribed my YouTube channel Literature Insights yet, so please subscribe it by pressing the bell icon for getting further notifications and updates of my coming videos. In this video, I have come up before you with 20 very important MCQs on the quest for happiness. The Quest for Happiness is a non-fictional prose written by Dalai Lama. As we know, Dalai Lama is a renowned Buddhist monk. He is known as a religious preacher, Buddhist scholar and spiritual writer on the international platform. In this essay, Dalai Lama has explained the three sources for happiness. And these sources are not enough to quest for happiness of human being. So here we can see there are three sources primarily he explained in his essay that is wealth, health and friendship. Let's study 20 very important MCQs on the quest for happiness. Question number one, Dalai Lama is renowned. Here are four options, A Buddhist, B monk, C both A and B, D none of these. The correct answer of this question is C both A and B. Dalai Lama is a renowned Buddhist monk. Question number 2. Dalai Lama was born on blank. Here are four options. A July 5, 1935. B. July 6, 1935 C. July 7, 1935 D. July 9, 1936 The correct answer of this question is B. July 6, 1935 Dalai Lama was born on July 6, 1935 Question number third When did Dalai Lama begin his monastic education? So now here again we can see four options a at the age of 9, B at the age of 5, C at the age of 4, D at the age of 6. The correct answer of this question is D at the age of 6. Dalai Lama began his monastic education at the age of 6. Question number 4. Dalai Lama was greatly influenced by four options are here A. Baba Sahib Ambedkar, B. Gautam Buddha. C. Lord. D. None of these. The correct answer of this question is B. Gautam Buddha. Dalai Lama was greatly influenced by Gautam Buddha. Question number 5. Dalai Lama was awarded the Nobel Prize for his non-violent struggle for the liberation of Tibet in Here are four options. A. 1987. B. 1988. C. 1989 D. 1990 The correct answer of this question is C. 1989 Dalai Lama was awarded the Nobel Prize for his non-violent struggle for the liberation of Tibet in 1989 Question number 6 Dalai Lama was a man of Again four options are here A. Freedom B. Peace C. Kindness. D. All of the above. The correct answer of this question is B. Peace. Dalai Lama was a man of peace. Question number 7. Dalai Lama's essay, The Quest for Happiness, is based on four options are here. A. In secular context. B. Secular context. C. Both A and B. D. None of these. The correct answer of this question is B. Secular context. Dalai Lama's essay, The Quest for Happiness, is based on secular context. Question number 8. Dalai Lama is widely known as blank preaches. Here are four options. A. Social. B. Economical. C. Religious. D. Cultural. The correct answer of this question is C. Religious. Dalai Lama is widely known as religious preaches. Question number 9. In the essay blank, 
Dalai Lama has explained the real sources of happiness. Here again we can see four options A the quest for happiness, B love, C courage, D the remorseful sinner. The correct answer of this question is A the quest for happiness. In the essay the quest for happiness Dalai Lama has explained the real sources of happiness. Question number 10. What according to Dalai Lama are the sources of happiness that contribute to human well-being? Again four options are here. A. Wealth. B. Health. C. Friendship. D. All of the above. The correct answer of this question is D. All of the above. According to Dalai Lama, wealth health and friendship are the real sources of happiness that contribute to human well-being question number 11 according to the Dalai lama blank is the master key of human happiness here we can see four options a satisfaction b inner state of mind c money d property the student has to identify the correct option out of these four options the correct answer of this question is B. Inner state of mind. According to the Dalai Lama, inner state of mind is the master key of human happiness. Question number 12. Which is an important factor in our quest to avoid suffering and achieve happiness? Four options are here. A. Peace. B. Secular. C. Money. D. Health. The student has to select the correct option out of these four options as an answer. The correct answer of this question is C. Money. Money is an important factor in our quest to avoid suffering and achieve happiness. So now here the money has its own importance. Question number 13. Tibetan calls money by the nickname. Here I have given four options. A. Mani Padme B. Kunga Dhundup C. Taspo D. Asa The student has to identify the correct option for this question as an answer. The correct answer of this question is B. Kunga Dhundup Tibetan calls money by the nickname Kunga Dhundup Question number 14 what are the fundamental needs of human being for happiness? So this is very basic questions. What are the fundamental needs of human being for getting happiness? Here I have given four options. A. Decent shelter. B. A healthy environment. C. Nutritious food and clean water. D. All of the above. Now it is a very simple question the student has to identify the correct option for this question and the correct answer is d all of the above decent shelter healthy environment and nutritious food and clean water are the fundamental needs or requirements of human being for happiness question number 15 in fact acquiring more possessions often leads to greater blank here I have given four options A. Anxiety B. Stress C. Worry D. All of the above In fact, when the people acquiring more possessions by their wealth often leads to greater Here I have given four options Student has to identify the correct option as an answer for this question The correct answer of this question is D. All of the above in fact, acquiring more possessions often leads to greater anxiety, stress, worry. Question number 16. According to Dalai Lama, what are the important suggestions for the physical health? Here I have given four options. A. Eat well. B. Sleep well. C. Take some exercise. D. All of the above. The correct answer of this question is D. All of the above. So it is very relevant for the present scenario we are suffering from COVID-19. So these suggestions are very helpful for the human being to lead their life happily. According to Dalai Lama, eat well, sleep well, take some exercises are the important suggestion 
for the physical health. Question number 17. Dalai Lama emphasizes that blank of human being is the ultimate key to happiness. Four options are here. A. Social level. B. Mental level. C. Physical level. D. Religious level. The correct answer of this question is B. Mental level. Dalai Lama emphasizes that mental level of human being is the ultimate key to happiness. Question number 18. The genuine friendship can only be best on. Four options are here. A. Trust. B. Affection. C. Both A and B. D. None of these. The correct answer of this question is C. Both A and B. The genuine friendship can only be best on trust and affection that comes through maturity and understanding. Question number 19. Is health a source of human happiness? So it is just a yes no type question. The student has to answer the correct option out of these four options. A. Yes. B. No. C. Sometime. D. None of these. The correct answer of this question is B. No. Health is not a source of human happiness. So now in the present prose, Dalai Lama has explained that the person having a good physical health or a strong physical health, he may be unhappy. Vice versa, the person is weak but he is happy. Health is not the ultimate source of human happiness. Question number 20. The mental benefits of wealth are blank. Again four options are here. A. Permanent. B. Temporary. C. Frequent. D. Rare. The correct answer of this question is B. Temporary. The mental benefits of wealth are temporary. These are the 20 very important MCQs on the quest for happiness. A prose is written by Dalai Lama. So these MCQs will be very useful for the learners of English language and literature in the preparation of their examinations. So if you like my videos on MCQs on the quest for happiness, so don't forget to watch my earlier videos. The Remorseful Sinner by Leo Tolstoy, Sniper by Liam O'Flaherty, Love by S.T. Coleridge. These MCQs also helpful in preparation of your examination. So if you have not subscribed my YouTube channel Literature Insights, so press the bell icon for getting further notifications and updates of my coming videos. So don't forget to like, share and subscribe my YouTube channel Literature Insights among your friends and students of English language and literature. Thank you for watching.